Your units are grouped into retinues, with each army consisting of up to three. Retinues are commanded by a character with their individual traits, skills, and attributes influencing the retinue that they're attached to. Each retinue can have a max of six units in it. Let's take a look at our retinues for this army in the lower left of the screen. Right-clicking a character and going to the Military tab will tell us the current retinue that they have, as well as any special units that they also have access to. We can find out how to unlock this retinue special units by hovering over the padlock. To unlock these archers, this character needs to reach rank 6. The units your character has access to are dictated by their class. This character is a commander. Let's click the Recruit button, then the plus symbol in that character's retinue. This shows us a number of units that this character can recruit. Clicking the plus symbol on another character will show us a different set of units dictated by that character's special unit. Retinues allow you to build flexibility into your armies, mixing the backline support of commanders with the aggressive charging tactics of a vanguard or the defensive tactics of a sentinel. Another feature of Even retinues the is the ability to quickly swap them for a character me. that better suits your army's needs. Let's select this character and click the Swap Lord? Selected Retinue button. This will bring up a list of available characters, the cost associated with swapping retinues, as well as the upkeep cost of that retinue. Selecting this character, we can see a preview of this retinue below to compare any units or traits we might want to. Lastly, let's press Confirm to lock this in. Mix and match retinues and characters to get the best possible combination for your army. If you get lost, simply press F1 and hover over your army to get a summary of your options. Have another question that isn't covered in this video? Browse the other videos on Total War Academy.